Hey everybody, well, today's a pretty windy day, and uh, I've been float flying all day with my cub over there. I don't know if you can see the yeah, eye, you can. Um, this is my lake right here. When I fly off of, there's my house back there, there's a truck, and there's another lake that I land on usually. Um, my plane's over there. It, uh, it flipped over three times already in the water. I'm pretty sure because there's a bunch of wind, but I thought you guys might get a kick out of that. Uh, it's flipped over with the stock set up, now it's got a Park 480 and stuff, but when it uh, flipped over with the stock set up, it was fine. And the 480, it's already flipped over three times. These are freshwater lakes, I think that's why, but I'm coming up to it now. See, it works fine. I put, put ailerons on it, got ailerons, no cow, because, well, I don't like the cow. So, here it is. Clean. I'm gonna put it back in the water. I don't have a uh, anything to film it with really, other than me. So me, myself, and I. So put it back in the water, and uh, I'm gonna take it off. There's my lake, and see, there's houses on either side. Over there, there's power lines. Over here, there's more houses and trees. It's so pretty much. I climb straight up with the 480, and I. Uh, sit up there for about 30 minutes and I can fly for a good while so I haven't crashed yet so well this plane other than tipping over I haven't crashed yet so just thought you guys might get a kick out of that I'm gonna taxi it around the lake for a second if you guys want to see so here we go put it in the lake right now Let's see if I can do this with the Let's see it's already turning Right into that bush. Yeah. See, things like this happen to me all the freaking time. There we go. Now that's full right rudder, but it really does not like to turn. And I cannot figure out which way the wind's blowing. We got crazy winds here. We got some storm coming in, a cold front. I don't know all the scrap. It's like 40 below right now or something like that. No, it's not because this lake would be frozen, but it's like 40 degrees. And there's birds over there, there's planes flying up above. It's a nice day to fly, but my plane keeps slipping over and I can't get it's it. Had up another in the successful air. flight. Didn't tip over this time. I went one, came up there, and about at that little right, let's see if I can get it in the camera. Right there. Right at the center of my finger. Right there. It uh tip stalled up and I gave it a little bit down elevator and it just it was going all sorts of ways, so I finally got it up. Once I got it up in the air, I did a couple passes, and I'm going to get somebody to film it. I'm going to have a, I'm not going to have, I do have a, um, a camera coming. I got a flip video for on the ground, and I have a uh, gumstick camera, like one of the ones from Grayson, but not really. Um, and I'm going to mount that in the cockpit. I'm going to mount one in the cockpit and one under and one facing straight. So I got three of them for almost as much as just one Grayson because you get them on eBay, you can get them for 25 bucks rather than 70 or 60 from Nitro Planes or Grayson or whoever. But, um, and they're the same quality. Still, you just got to check for 640 by 480 and 30 frames per second and how much shipping is. So. I did a little bit of research, found out which one was the best, and they're coming now, of course from Hong Kong, so that kind of sucks, but whatever. And next week, I have an F-16 coming. It's a one from Banana Hobby. I haven't had very good luck with Banana Hobby, Hobby but they uh, they were the only ones that weren't sold out of the F F-16, so um, I was pretty excited. And I was like, okay, well, might as well, maybe they can get it here before. Christmas, which is on Thursday, which, or on Friday, actually, so they'd have to get it here by Thursday, so, uh, that's all right now, so, I ordered it yesterday, today's Monday, so, I'll do an out-of-box review from that, I'll do a flight review, and tell you how it went, um, most likely from my strip right here, uh, it has a speed bump right in the center, that's what those yellow signs are, so, it's kind of confusing and challenging, and that's why I like it, so. It was pretty windy today, but I had a good flight. Skipped up on the landing. Kind of sucked, but whatever. It was good. So, have a good day. Everybody. Last video for the day, actually. I've probably put up three by now, so um, just thought this was kind of funny, too. After my flipping, I had a great, successful flight. 
put the new battery in it, and it went right down the runway, came right in this little crevice, went right into that tree, and into this person's yard. So, it has an electric fence. So I was planning on not going in there. They also have a dog. So, I uh, went and asked the owner, and now I got my plane back. It looks like the only damage is this. The flute's being ripped out. Boom.